Hi everyone! In this video, you will learn how to insert and modify tables. How to insert a blank table. So let's say, gagamitin natin itong characteristics of computer. Ilalagay natin siya sa table. So ilang row ang kakailanganin natin. So 1, 2, 3, 4, and five, five rows and two columns. So let's say insert tayo ng table sa area na to. Go to insert tab, then table. So ilang row, five rows, one, two, three, four, five, and two columns. Alright, then, so ilipat natin si See characteristics. Speed. Ang copy paste na lang natin para mas madali. Storage. And then versatility. And then kanyang description. storage capability and then alright so nasa table na siya and then kung gusto natin maglagay ng table header or yun uh, description ng bawat uh, columns natin so punta tayo sa layout and then Lagay natin yung insertion point or cursor dito sa taas sa unang column. And then, mag insert tayo ng additional row sa taas. So, insert above. Ayan. Then, let's name it uh, characteristics. And then, description. Gawin natin bold. So this one is description. So, since my table na tayo, Dapat meron siyang table number and description. So, lalagay natin yung table number and description sa taas ng table. Table number 1. And description niya is characteristics of a computer. Okay. So, I bold natin. And then next is, I use natin yung table. So, highlight natin yung table. And then, dito sa layout. So, huwag na natin pahirapan mga sarili natin. So, from dito sa auto fit. Then, auto fit contents. And then, si position natin, i-align natin yung table sa center. So, go to Home tab. And then, select natin si Align Center. And, and then, kung gusto natin lagyan ng design yung table. So, select natin yung table. Then, go to Design. And then, mamili tayo ng Design na gusto natin. So, let's say this one. Ayan. Okay. So, again, pag meron tayong table sa document, Dapat yung table number and description ng table nasa taas. 
pag-figure naman, pag-figure like graph, uh, graph or images, chart, or um, other kinds of figure. So, sa baba naman, ilalagay yung figure number and description ng figure. Okay. So, since meron na tayong characteristics, nailagay na natin sa table, delete na natin tong part na to. Next is, actually, so pwede natin i-convert yung existing uh, text to table. So, pwede natin i-convert ito sa table. So, ang gagawin natin is, i-highlight natin yung text na i-convert natin to table. And then, remove na natin itong uh, bullets. And then, go to insert table. Then, convert text to table. So, separate text at, so, since colon, so, colon yung lalagay natin dito sa other. Kung hindi siya separated by commas or tabs, so, lalagay natin dito sa other is yung colon. So, naka-separate siya by colon. Then, click OK. So, ayan, may table na tayo. And then, um, insert ulit tayo ng uh, table header. So, lagay natin yung cursor dito sa unang column or unang row. And then, let's go to layout. And then, insert tayo ng uh, row above. And then, separate, separate natin yung year. So, insert tayo ng another column dito. So, insert ng column. Insert to uh, right. Ayan, dito. Okay, so ito ay generation then year and then hardware technology all right so separate natin to lagay natin sa year so konting uh, ayos na lang dahil uh, meron nang nakasulat nakatype Separate natin itong gear. And then, so let's make this bold, no? Control B. Alright. And then, pwede ulit natin siyang lagyan ng design kung gusto natin. Ayusin mo na natin yung table ulit. So, auto fit, auto fit content. Ayan. And then, apply tayo ng design. Sana bang magandang design? Aha. Pares na natin sa isang design para parehas. Kung gusto lang na magkaparehas. And then, lagay natin sa, i-align natin sa center. Alright. So, this is uh, table number 2. Kasi meron tayong table number 1. Table number 2. Alright. So, ganun lang mag-insert ng table. And, ganun lang mag-
convert sa existing text to table.